She swam, she dove, she ran, she jumped. She could throw a softball further than a lot of the boys. She could catch too. And she was a natural with a basketball. She was Marion Clark Knowles, a multi-sport athlete who grew up in East London where she was a playground champion and later an elite class softball pitcher and basketball star. In the late 1940s and throughout the next decade, she made headlines as a leader on the London Shamrocks basketball squad that won the 1945 Eastern Canada Women's Senior Championship. Three years later, she pitched the London Supremes to the Michigan Ontario Championship and a Challenge Series triumph over the Orange County Lionettes, the North American champions down in California. The late Bill Farkason, then London's Recreation Director, was manager, coach, and mastermind of both teams, although Cease Hill coached the Supremes during their championship season. Clarky was just a natural, recalled her childhood friend, Helen Gorman Brulat. She was a very good all-around athlete, a standout in any sport, and boy how she could pitch. I was her catcher for several years, and I would often come home with a bruised hand from her pitches. My mother would say, why do you keep doing that? because Marion is my friend, I would say. The lineups of the Supremes and the Shamrocks were often interchangeable, and their exploits led to long-lasting friendships. They would gather on summer days at the Berlotts' farm to reminisce and attempt to capture their fleeting youth. Inevitably, Marion Clark's name would enter the conversation with anecdotes of her pitching and basketball talents. Marion married Bill Knowles in 1949, and close friend and teammate Irene Witterburn Brownlee was her maid of honor. She also attested to Marion's athletic prowess. Sadly, Marion Clark Knowles died in May of 1978 at age 51. The London Sports Hall of Fame is pleased to honor the memory of one of the city's outstanding athletes as an inductee amongst our legends. <laughs>